Hi there, this is Andrea York with Catch the Fire Worship Flags. This is take three, so I think it's working. And I'm going to just wait a moment to see who, if anyone's catching the notifications. Can you hear me? Hey Rosie, can you hear me? Yeah, you're watching. I was having some problems. Okay, great. So this is the weekly for the week of uh, September 12th, uh, 2018, and this is your place for worship encouragement to help you elevate your praise. So today, uh, yesterday was a really somber day. We had, uh, we actually have in our group, if you're not part of the Fire Catchers group, this is just a little plug to be involved with us and to have, um, enjoy the community that we have in the group one of our fire catchers who is part of the flagging communi community um, around the internet, uh, she, she shared a story. It was the first time that I'd actually heard of a, a survivor or anybody who had been closely related to the 9-11 uh, attacks, the terrorist attacks, and, and she was able to share a little bit of a story that she was personally involved. I've only heard from, at the memorial the, the volunteers there. So. Um, it was, it was a good day to just celebrate the freedom that we have and to remember uh, the te what, what terrorism really does. And so today, who are you? Um, so my son is, I think I've shared with you, my son is in grade 12. And up until this year, he's been in a private Christian school. For, well, he started in public school and then he moved into a, a private Christian school. And he's moved back into the the public school and I've been watching him so this is his first full week of school we start a little bit later than most of the places in the United States and this is the first full week of school for him and just watching him try to find his place and I see him describe what's going on in the lunchroom and you've got the, the sports kids and you've got the rich kids and you've got uh, the ones that are smart and and all of the different kinds of of people that there are in his school and I'm watching him try to find his place and it is it just kind of reminded me and how I was how we all were being 17 15 16 17 that's such a difficult age because you don't know who you are and you don't know so you try on a lot of different costumes shall I say you try on these different things to say who am I uh, Am I the jock? Am I going to be the bad kid? Am I going to be the funny kid? Am I going to, uh, which, which group is going to accept me? And so we have been, we've introduced the new identity collection. This has just been one of my life messages for sure. Who are you? And so uh, that just actually leads into our fire catchers classroom event this Saturday on, on September 15th at 9am. Uh, my mom's watching. Hi mom. Uh, my mom is in the States right now, and so I haven't been able to talk to my mom for a bit. Uh, but this weekend, we're going to be, I'm going to be teaching about the uh, identity. Who are you? Uh, we'll introduce a little bit of the flags. It's not even about that, but it is just about who are you? Uh, and we're going to find out what God has to say about us. And the book club we have coming up the following Friday. So I think that's in what, 10 days on the 21st. So I know this is Facebook Live, so you can, this is backwards, but this is what the book looks like. It's called Glory. It's by Ruth Ward Heflin. Um, you still have time to be able to pick it up and read it or try to read it uh, and then join us in the, the online book club. That will be for uh, 6.30 uh, PST time. So wherever you are, it's West Coast, it's going to be at 630. So Glory by Ruth Ward Heflin. Pick that up. Even if you don't read it, please join us. We just love to have conversations, talk about worship, talk about what God is revealing. Uh, trending items, trending products this week is definitely holy and blameless. That has been flying off. Uh, now, admittedly, I didn't have a ton of things. Uh, some of the identity collection will be sold out very soon if we're going the way that we're going. And I here have in my hands the very last holy 
and blameless. So if you are thinking about getting this, don't wait. This is the last one that I have in stock. Other flags that have been trending uh, was the knowledge knowledge of the glory that's been selling we introduced the traveler collection which is a fantastic collection that allows you to take the multi-layer worship flags everywhere you go so that you can worship everywhere and in we have a promo actually in the traveler collection that if you buy two traveler flags travel the multi-layer traveler flags you will get a pair of interchangeable travel poles for free so that is a $54 value that you get to you only need one pair of poles for any number of the travel worship flags and we've started with the four that we've introduced I'll be introducing them with the new collections and different things like that so keep that in mind I'm gonna keep the short and sweet if you see this shirt uh, I know that it's backwards. It's uh, if we, what does it say? They shall uh, mount up on wings of like eagles. Uh, and this is the fire catchers. This is a worship flag. This is done by, created by Angel Purdy. She's in our group. These are going to be available on the website very, very soon. Uh, I have now three. She has three different styles. I have them all. Um, they're great. They're fantastic cotton. They're a really nice fit. They fit larger so that they don't feel um, tight or anything and I love them they don't shrink they don't so far it's been very color fast too uh, so I just really like these shirts and that's going to be available that is it for the weekly I will catch you next week if I don't see you on in the classroom on Saturday if you are on uh, if you're in our Facebook group that's great. You're going to have the information there. If you're not yet a fire catcher and in the group, we'll post a link to get you into that group because uh, that's where all the information will be, uh, be held and that's where we keep it and that's where we have so much fun online just connecting, supporting, and praying for one another. So until next week, I love you guys. Bye.